In this video, you'll learn how to debug flows for agent force actions. As you can see here, I'm working on my agent force service agent. I want to give it the ability to book activities for customers. I specifically created an agent force action for this purpose that uses a flow behind the scenes. Now, when I use the flow myself, it works as expected. But when I try it in agent builder, it fails. Specifically, it fails at the create experience session booking action step. And it doesn't give me much information on why. So how do we debug this? We'll start by hopping into the create experience session booking flow that's powering the action behind the scenes and running it in debug mode. When we do this, we run it as our user, which is an admin, and it works. This confirms that the flow is correct, but it doesn't really let us know why it's failing for the agent. Luckily, with flows, we can run it as another user. But in my org, this capability is currently disabled. So let's go ahead and enable it. We'll navigate to process automation settings and then find the option that lets admins run flows as other users and enable it. Now let's hop back into our flow and try to run the flow as the Coral Cloud user. And here we see the issue. We can't create the booking record. Specifically, we're trying to do an insert using a field that we don't have access to. Navigating to our Coral Cloud agent user and setup, we see that the profile for this user is custom Einstein agent user. So let's check the booking field security for that profile. And here we see that the number of guest fields has a read only access, but not edit access. Let's change that. Now, when we rerun the flow as a Coral Cloud agent, it works. Great. We've successfully debugged this flow and got our action working. Now our guests can book activities with our agent. One of the benefits of agent force is that it respects the security and permission rules you set for your agents. But this means that you can occasionally run into issues just like this one. But by debugging flows in your Apex and vocable methods as our agent force agent user, we can get to the bottom of our issues and solve them easily. Thank you so much for watching this video and we'll see you in the next one.